Hello and welcome to the Cornwall Reports News Briefing for Monday the 16th of December. The local media headlines today. Cornwall's MPs are on their way to Westminster for the resumption of parliamentary business tomorrow. They're hoping they're going to get Brexit done within the next seven weeks. One of those MPs will be taking her seat for the first time. Sherilyn McCrory, the new MP for Truro and Falmouth, is also a Cornwall councillor. It's expected she'll resign that position at some point in the near future. Cornwall Reports also looks forward to the construction of four new cycle trails between St Agnes and Newquay to the west of Truro. Most of the money is coming from central government. Pirate FM reported that seasonal story about how many children in Cornwall will be spending this Christmas without a home. Nearly a hundred are in temporary accommodation, according to government statistics. The housing charity Shelter says the number is a scandal. The Falmouth Packet reported how weekend shoppers were treated to fake snow for the start of a Santa fun run. The Cornish Times asks what it means to actually be Cornish in the 21st century. The Buden Stratton Post congratulates the Crackington Haven Institute for raising a thousand pounds for charity. And finally, Cornwall Live offers tips to boyfriends who are thinking of buying Christmas trinkets for their girlfriends. And those are the local media headlines for now. Thank you very much for watching. Do please share this video on social media. I'll be back again tomorrow. See you then. Bye bye.